It, we have to dig a little deeper into the toolbox. We have a lot deeper into the toolbox. We need uh, both hard science and social sciences. We need both sides of the brain, whatever analogy you'd like to use. Uh, those, we need a broader set of skills, but those skills have to work together. How are we going to be successful in the future? And it takes design and engineers coming together, um, centered around human-centered designs, so that we actually deliver meaningful things for people in the world today. And we specifically have a mission of making people's lives better. You consider the number of parts, the, the number of engineering centers we have, the number of the supply base. You're, you're working with companies that will never meet each other, but when their parts come together, it all has to look like it was engineered by a single craftsman specifically for you to deliver an experience that, that you want. Then there comes this critical point in time where you need to start making things. <laughs> um, this is called, you know, we call it prototyping. Uh, we make to learn, we make to um, communicate our ideas. Um, and that's very important, and we can do this in very low fidelity ways. We can do paper sketches, we can use cardboard, whatever it might be, 2D, 3D, to express that idea. Um, words don't quite do it. People walk out of a room with many different interpretations of what those words might be. It, certainly it's a, based on a foundation of hard science and math, but it has to be more than that. You have to really just reach in and understand that uh, while we are scientists, applied scientists, uh, social scientists, we're also, we are people, and you need to interact in a very rich and meaningful way with your coworkers around the world to really bring out that essence. We're trying to design for actual people in the world, so always bringing the teams back to what is the problem we're trying to solve, who are the people we're trying to solve for, and how are we gonna do that in a compelling way for Ford?